Hey guys, sorry to interrupt this vlog, but I felt like this was a perfect time to show you guys my keyboard collection because I got a few questions from my last vlog about what keyboards I use. So I figured I would give you a really quick overview. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with this one, which is the one that you guys asked me about a lot. Now this is a Lofri Touch keyboard. It's a triple mode mechanical keyboard. This board is actually the original tofu design. However, I've added these beautiful Dear Kitty keycaps on it, which I really like the color scheme of. It has PBT keycaps and Gateron G Pro switches. This is probably my second favorite out of all four. Next up, we have the Dust Silver Blue Pink Milkshake 75% keyboard. I forgot to mention, but on the last one that I just showed you and this one, it has wireless Bluetooth and wired connection. And they both have adjustable feet to change the height of the keyboard as well. Now again, this is a mechanical keyboard and I believe that I have the Gateron red switches on this keyboard. Now this one, I would actually rate number three in my collection. Now this is the Razer the Huntsman 10 keyless keyboard and this is a mechanical gaming keyboard. This is in a beautiful candy pink. However, the biggest downside to this keyboard is that it is only or it only has a wired option. So there is no Bluetooth option with this keyboard, which definitely puts me off using it often. Now, what surprised me most about this keyboard is how much I actually loved the sound of this keyboard. So normally gaming keyboards have louder, more clicky switches but this particular keyboard actually has Razer lineal optical switches. The back of this keyboard is even pretty. I mean, the whole thing is just absolutely gorgeous. And obviously it matches the rest of my Razer peripherals, which is why I wanted it. But this is actually my favorite keyboard at the moment. And it is the Logitech Casa key. What I love about this is how it actually mimics the kind of like Mac keyboard. For example, I have a little emoji key. I can easily screenshot, mute, control my volume and everything like that from this keyboard. Whereas when I'm using my other keyboards, I can't do that or I have to set up keyboard shortcuts. This is also just very quiet. So really, really nice to type on. And I just love the feel of the keys. But yeah, that is a full view of my keyboard collection. And yeah, let's get on with the rest of the vlog. So my days in the office actually start a little bit later than you'd probably expect. I actually usually get into the office around half nine to 10. The reason for this is that simply I can get cheaper trains if I leave a little bit later and I always do kind of some admin work on the train anyway so I don't really feel like I'm losing out too much of my day. Plus being in academia means that your work hours are kind of a little bit more flexible than other industries I guess. Anyone who doesn't know, I actually recently just completed my PhD and I'm now a research scientist. I'm currently working with genetic and epigenetic data for many different patients with motor neuron disease and I'm basically building, in the simplest of terms, some statistical models to try and understand more about this disease. So typically I spend all of my time writing code to produce these statistical models. So that's usually what I am doing in the hours before my meetings in the office is just continuing to write my code. However, this morning I was actually also trying to develop some project proposals 
for some new students. Essentially, we want to take on some students in order to teach them a little bit about what we do and get them to basically complete like a little mini project. So I was basically just brainstorming some ideas and fingers crossed, I've actually come up with a really exciting project that they can work on, which will eventually actually be something that I will be able to use in my job as well, if that makes sense. So yeah, that took me a few hours this morning as well. And then you guys know the drill. It was time to go and get bubble tea. <laughs> I wondered where everyone was then. I was like, am I in the wrong room? <laughs> 